Online editing technology has been steadily evolving since the web became popular in the 1990s. First-generation online editing solutions were form-based and limited by the capabilities of web browsers. A user would enter information on a form and get back a document that had merged those fields with a document template. The server had full responsibility for all formatting. Around the year 2000, as browsers got more powerful, with JavaScript, CSS, SVG, and plugins such as Flash, things got more interesting. Editors such as Silicon Designer began to offer full WYSIWYG authoring. This empowers users to directly edit in text and preview on the web client itself without having to wait for an update. You could drag and drop an image onto the document and crop and scale in real time, much like desktop page layout applications. Some solutions tried to be as robust as Adobe InDesign. However, the real power of online editing is not that it lets designers edit in a different way, but that a browser-based solution could offer a user experience without the learning curve of professional design software. With online editing solutions, non-designers can work in an easy-to-use, intuitive environment editing branded templates. A salesperson could change a price, a legal department could edit a disclaimer. This is liberating by avoiding cumbersome back and forth between non-designers and designers. It empowers business users and consumers to create gorgeous documents easily. The design comes from the template, and the interface guides and constrains the user to stay consistent with the vision of the designer who created that template. Web technology continues to advance, and online design tools continue to gain adoption. Wow. Desktop tools are not going away. Creatives and their professional tools can have greater impact through integration with online design solutions.